Well, I don't ever want to judge a book by its cover, but... Piss boy, piss boy. You can go back in there. Ah, I remember this little little gem that I found in my cleavage. Ah, the story of a magical son and a fiery father. Ah, what a, what a time to be alive. It was literally yesterday. But, we're not here to discuss my son any longer, unless he shows up in this. But we're doing the whistleblower. Blow. Blow her. Let's dive on in. Uh, I'm not going to do insane, because I, you know, don't want to fucking... I don't really want to jump off the roof of my house, because, well, I'm not I'm not going to replay a five-hour DLC, because I die once. Let's go with Nightmare. Let's see what gets thrown at us. I'm actually really excited to see what the fuck this is about, because I, once again, have no clue. Uh, hello? Where, where am I? Liam Neeson? Uh, you're, you're awfully strong. I'm very blue. I like the blue M&M bloke. Open those eyes. You don't have to wake up, but open your eyes. What's the matter? Somebody hit you? Here. Let me help. Uh, Andrew? You getting these alerts? Kind of busy here. It sounds like real trouble. Uh, at the engine, they said Hope made a lateral assumption. What do we hope? Shit. They're not happy about it? No. Shit, shit, shit. Come on. Um. Hello, hello, Bill. I'm back. I. D he licked me. Thoroughly. You don't know me, you have to make this quick, they might be monitoring. I did two weeks of software console at Murkoff, psychiatric systems, facilities, and Mount Massive Michael, all sorts of NDAs I'm very much breaking right now. He's getting too far away. There's the fucking first letter that we read um, at the beginning of the main story, I'm pretty sure. This makes sense, whistleblower. He's blowing the whistle on all the fucked up shit going on here. He's There's the orderly, I'm guessing. Murkoff is making money. It needs to be exposed. Send that shit. Hello. Coffee. It's all run dry. Hi, I'm going to call you Jeremiah. Okay. Um doing in here anyway? I thought you were just a software guy. I am. I was doing software things. I was I was uh employee one four six six. Report to Corpogenic Engine monitoring immediately. I was jerking the pickle, mate. Um I don't like I don't like that I'm uh already locked. Why would I even assume that I could be doing that? I'm down below with Billy. Shit. Hello, gents. Yeah, I hope we're inventing something else than that too. You're Wayland Park, aren't you? Why weren't you answering the page? I'll tell them you want to find me. Alright, cheers, mate. Um, you probably don't want to know why I wasn't answering the page. I'll go through here. Excuse me, mate. No. So this is, uh, well, this is before 
Everyone was alive. Hello. Waiting on me to do what, mate? Okay. Oh god, the sphere. Yeah? Maybe? Are we happy, Mr. Park? Uh, Steve? FMRI is still dark. You're doubting our friend, Mr. Wayland Park? Which I consider more than unkind to his programming skill and considerable dedication to the Murtaugh Corporation. Fuck me, they're bringing him in. yourself this is a high security it's all right agent mr park was just surprised i'm sure he's still calm and eager to finish his work take your seat quickly mr park it will need to roll if the fusion monitoring is not active when we put him in the engine five seconds four three our serial spin labeling is back online good news hi bill Cheers, mate. Um, that was fucked. Uh, I mean, I'm working on Billy. Alright, alright, I get it. I was working on Billy, really? God damn. I guess I'm more than just an orderly. I'm the goddamn Grim Reaper of IT. Hello, fellas. Let me just go grab my laptop and, uh, boy, I hope nothing bad happens to me, like a man licking my face. Anyone? Somebody's been telling stories outside of class. On the floor! Down! Hands where I can see them! Mr. Whalen Park. Consulting contract 8208. Software engineer with a level three security clearance. Graduated cum laude from Berkeley, but still somehow not smart enough to realize that the last thing a fly ought to do in a spider's web is wiggle. Somehow dumb enough to think that a borrowed laptop, onion router, and firewall patch would be enough to fool the world's leading supplier of biometric security. Stupid, Mr. Park. More than stupid, in fact. That was crazy. I'm afraid we're going to have to have you committed. Mr. Park, will you willingly submit to forced confinement? Did you hear that, Agent? He said yes, Mr. Blair. Great. Oh, and uh, did I just hear Mr. Whalen Park volunteer for the Morphogenic Engine Program? Well, that's what I heard, Mr. Blair. That was brave indeed, Whalen. The Murkoff Corporation and the Onward March of Science both appreciate your bravery and sacrifice. Maybe you could administer Mr. Park here a light anesthetic. Gladly. Ow. Ow, my bones. Blow my whistle. Choo choo. That's not a whistle. Oh, God. This is going to be more fucked, isn't it? Hello, Billy, I think. Oh. 
the hell? Oh god. Oh, fuck. Oh, uh, Billy, no. Please, not again. You already got me last time. Don't do this to me. Fucking Jesus, take that. Take that fucking camera. Once again, back in the saddle. Uh. Oh, why'd he go for everyone but me? Why is it not open? How do I get out? The vent. Oh. Um. I'm not waiting for you, mate. Wait, are you gonna hurt me? Oh, no, you're not. Where are you? Bloody hell. Um, did he get possessed and he let me out? You know what, fuck it. I don't have time to... Yeah, okay. I'm out. Let's hope that no one's... Ugh. No. Billy, no. Right, shit, shit, shit. Oh, fucking hell, what's in here? More shit. Oh, back in the toilets already. Anything else? Shit. And let me guess. More poo. Right. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, what are they doing in there? Oh, oh, why? Why? Oh, fellas. Come to join our therapy session. It's always healthy to express yourself. You keep it bottled up too long and you might do something you regret. No. You're one of those. Too good for the likes of us. Think you're different? Something special? There are no observers here. Now, get the fuck out of here before I change my mind. Oh, righty Roo. I, uh, I understand. Oh, fuck. Hey, mate. What's so special about you, then? Why are you the friendly neighborhood? Oh, oh, oh. What? 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 Why? Why? What's your problem, man? Shit. What? What is your problem? Oh, I thought he was going to jump scare me, but no, he just fucking punches me right in the mouth. Right, bye. I'm out of here, mate. I'm gone, mate. No, no thank you. Goodbye and good night. Fucking Billy, man. responsibility for every legally shaky thing you did on the Mercom company payroll. I know I don't. It's too late to worry about that. It's just there's some You're scared. You're not thinking straight. Let me make something clear. You try to radio on site for help. I'm gonna give you a whole new subgroup to be scared of. Are you threatening me? Yes. Oh. Yes. Yes, I am. Even the guards are fucking terrified of this place. I don't blame them, to be honest. Why? Oh, God, this really throws you in. 
Like, throws you in right at the... Oh, hello. Oh, no. No, Billy. Is he possessing everyone else or something? Oh, I hate... You're moving around, aren't you, mate? Hi? You coming with me? No? This just throws you into the worst section of the game. What the hell was that? Um. Yeah. Yeah. Fair. Sorry, mate. I'm not really here to have any fun with you. Oh. He really doesn't like doctors. The doctor is no longer in. Seeing a lot more fucking doctors than last time. But to be fair, the last one just wanted my bum. Goodbye, Billy. You're not getting me this time. I refuse. Come on. Another one's coming. What do you mean? Uh, uh, what? You, you cock. Shit. Another what's coming. Oh, information. Look at my feet. I've got such pristine little feet. Documents. Resignation of Wayland Park. Ah, uh, Miss Grant, you may receive requests for information from a Mrs. Lisa Park of Leadville, CO, in the coming weeks concerning the resignation and hospitalization of her husband, Waylon. If so, please forward them to my personal attention. Waylon Park, former consulting contract 8208, resigned due to previously undiagnosed mental illness. I personally visited Mrs. Lisa Park and her sons and broke the news to them. With the silver lining that Murkoff psychiatric would be graciously graciously providing treatment. Mrs. Park had some less than charitable things to say about myself and the Murkoff... Oh, no. Murkoff Corporation. I assured, I assured her that with her power of attorney, she could try to fight the doctor's diagnosis of her husband's illness. However, if it were discovered that he resigned under false pretenses, his insurance would be cancelled and the family would be saddled with not insignificant healthcare debts. Hopefully she understood, but if she insists on making a nuisance of herself or tries to get around me, please let me know. There's one I want to take care of personally. Yours, Jeremy Blair. So that's the asshole from earlier that caught me uh, whistle blowing my, my fucking whistle. Can I go up here? Or is this going to be really weird? Oh no, this is the way. I don't feel like this is a nice way, but... Oh, God. I shot doors so slowly in this one. At least that's how it feels. Okay. Uh, anybody home? Oh, God. Oh, blood. Blood, lots of... Blood. What are you doing in there, mate? Hi there, you're literally chainsawing people up. I don't want any of that. Shit. Shit, it's locked. Um. Oh, oh. Why? Why would you even do that? Oh, God. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're a little cannibal boy. Oh, Jesus. Bloody hell. This is already way worse than the fucking main game. So much is already happening. What's that? No, no, no. No! Hello, Bill. Goodbye, Bill. Reload the camera. Turn it around. Don't want to blind everyone again. Can you climb up? I'm coming, Cooper! 
Okay, well some people are getting out. I like that I'm getting the point of view from all the um, patients and shit before everything went down. It is intriguing me. Wait, can I... Can I go through here? No, it's locked. Was fully expecting someone to be at the door. But I haven't had one of those bad boys come up to me yet. Hello? Oh, God, cannibal boy. Oh, God. Oh, the days where I miss my son. Where, 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 go. He can smell me. Come on, what's my name again? I don't even remember my name. Um, Waylon? Come on, Waylon. You can run faster than that. Crawl through the fucking... Oh, God. Hello? Nope. Just gonna run. Handcuff. Handcuff keys. He's kicking something down. Oh, thank God. Information. Oh, God. Where'd you go, mate? Where did you go? Oh, fuck. Oh, he's... He's coming. Oh, where is he? Oh, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, you'll find another way, will you? Yeah, well, I'm getting the hell out of here. Of course. The first fucking bit of the game, I had big old son Michael. Now I've got Cannibal Boy. Is who doesn't love that? What the hell is going on over there? Oh, not that. Uh, documents. Gender selection and mount massive Michael contractors. Alrighty. All material herein to be transcribed called in form uh, 4083 with forensic revisions as benefits ongoing lawsuit. Ethan... I'm not even going to try and say that. This is a request for specific legal con oh my God. consultation in the ongoing lawsuit by Melissa Cho against Murkoff Charitable Psychiatry. Uh, Incorporated USA, original filed in 2010. At the time of Ms. Cho's termination, the psychosomatic effects of the morphogenic engine on female employees and patients had been well established. Already more than seven female employees and patients had reached fictitious half-term pregnancies in a matter of weeks before miscarrying the non-existent children, five of them fatally. Female employees were moved to higher floors in the facility and into other buildings and eventually entirely off of the Mount Massive Michael facility. The critical secrecy of Project Wall Rider Ness... Nessus... Words. Secrecy in the motivating factor for the reassignments and terminations, resulting in perceived injustice from several terminated parties. Ms. Cho has succeeded in acquiring a court-ordered FOIA release of the documents surrounding her termination. Those documents will need to be generated and post-dated, providing ameliorating information? What the fuck does that mean? While skirting the relevant secrecies of the project, please advise Ethan Words. Consultant. Alright, fair enough, mate. You seem to have a lot on your plate. Miss Cho's obviously not, uh... Well, she's probably dead, right? Like how that man's dead. And he, he crawled pretty far. But he didn't crawl far enough. That's open. What's in here? Good day. It's a hidey hole. And a battery. Lovely. Alright, well, at least I got that area to fucking hide in. I don't like that... What was that? I heard a little bash. Did no one want to come on in? I get out of here. Oh, what the hell? All right. All right. Yeah. Please don't. Yeah! You fucker. 
Get off me. Get away. What are you doing? Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Uh, uh. Come on. Come on. Let me out. I'm cooking. Oh. Is that him? Oh, God. I don't know what's worse. Stop shutting doors so slowly. Learn from Mr. Upshirt. He knew how to shut a door. Alex. The lovely bleach you can consume for the price of five. Alright, well. There's a dead body here. And then there's... Uh, uh, there's so many fucking... Plucking? So many fucking ways to go. Wait a minute. He's still in there. I'm wondering why the fuck I'm even wandering around. I could just get out of here. Oh, that guy was a little bitch. Do not like him. Although I was expecting I'd be able to cook him or something. That hurts me, really. But I guess not. What the hell? I was literally wondering if I could get up here. Oh, this is the way I gotta go. Alright, well, before we go up there, let us investigate the other rooms of doom. Good day. Ah, it's the father's room. Absolutely bodacious. Lovely. Thanks, Dad. Although you're not my dad in this one. Documents. God and family. Father Clark, far be it from me to lie to a man of God, so let me at least say that I will do my personal best to improve the safety of your working conditions. I and the rest of the staff truly appreciate everything you do for our patients. And if you feel threatened by anybody in particular, simply let us know and we can either increase chemical restraints or administer a lobotomy or similar calming procedure. Don't underestimate the contribution your sermons offer our patients, especially considering the depth and necessarily chaotic nature of hypnotherapy. Our patients need the bedrocks of God and family. Not all of our poor unfortunates have families to call upon. And so the burden and calling is yours. We're all of, we are all of us relying on your faith and hard work. Dr. Newhouse, 1961. That's an old ass document right there. But... I can, uh, I can respect it, even though he's fucking hypnotherapizing people into doing all kinds of wacky shit. But, let's go and have a look at this bloody poodle, and by that I mean a large dead man. Look at you. You just had to go and waste it, didn't you? Your parkour skills were not up to match, mate. Match? Par? Something. Words. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's get out of the basement where Billy is. Cause my god, is it horrible. Come on. This is quite cool, though. I have no idea... Um... What part I'm climbing up of the asylum, though. Don't remember... Oh, wait, I could be going through the sewers, maybe. This was really deep underground. Still... Oh, god. Oh, god, no, Billy. Billy, not like this. Nope. Nope. No. You go to hell, boy. Ah, uh, uh, where? Ah, uh, bollocks. Oh, he's leaving me alone. Do I go around there? How? I don't get it. Oh, no, I don't. I can crouch. Come on. Oh, Waylon. We're in trouble, mate. Hate this. Really hate this. Oh, fuck. Well, the thing that killed that guy's got to be around here, right? No. 
I don't want to uh, buy any of your chocolate bars. Thank you very much. Oh, it's locked. Hello? Good salesman. Here to offer you some fabulous socks for the low, low price of your dignity. You have enough dignity where you think, I could pull off some socks. Oh, fuck off. Where you at? Eh? I know you're in here. Shit, it's locked. Oh, cannibal boy. How did you even get up here? Um... Was that the one I opened? Oh, it was the one I opened. Hi. Hello. Oh! I don't want to feed you. You fucker. You little bastard. I'm not feeding you, okay? You got enough fucking skin on your bones, mate. Yeah, I'm out. I'm out of here. Um... Oh, feed me. Feed me. What? Oh. Well, I don't ever want to judge a book by its cover, but... Piss boy, piss boy. You can go back in there. Let's just shut that. I hate how slowly I open and shut things. Why am I so delicate? I'm just going to leave them to it, I think. Hello. I'm back where I started, I'm pretty sure. Oh! I can't, mate. Sorry. You scared me. Find the valve and shove the gas to the main airlock. Well, if I could find my way around, I would, mate. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. God. Wait. Oh! Why? Oh. You're gonna do something to me, aren't you? E-237. Oh. Asshole. Who just does that? I mean, he is insane, but... Do you reckon I'll do it again? Oh, it's locked. Alright. Well, um... This looks like a chase scene. E229. Oh, God. What's that? Oh, no, that's just a hide. 227. Nothing going on in here. All right. Random ass hatch that I can go through. Why? Because why not? Why not just dream big? Go in as many vents as you want. Have a latte on the house. Stop bashing your head against the fucking door, mate. Hello? You would be correct, sir. Although, I'm gone. I'm as fast as lightning and as thick as thunder. You can't try to clap these cheeks. Where'd you go? Fuck it. Where you at, cannibal boy? Ah, right. I'm gone, mate. Crap. Crap. Oh, he's coming. Oh, he's thick. He's got joints. Oh. Nope. Shit. 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 Oh. God damn. Bloody hell. 
That's a cross. Cross and a half. Wait. Isn't this... No. Why can't he just fuck off already? Oh! No. Oh. Oh, no. No. Confidential. Project Wall Rider patient status report from Frank Manera. Oh, Mount Massive Michael CO, case number 209. Consultation dated 2012. Initial date of patient consult 2010. Patient age 36. Gender male. Observing physician Dr. Carl Houston. Therapy status minimal morphogenic engine activity and only at extreme stages 5 and 6 levels of hormone therapy. Dream states return repeatedly to images of isolation and betrayal. Zero lucid state. Diagnostics. Heavy bronchial accum accumulation consistent with patients with histories of tobacco and marijuana. Exceptionally low REM activity. Interview notes. At the time of this interview, Frank was down to 155 pounds from his admission weight of 228. He was lethargic and largely non-responsive, exhibiting interest only in the... Hypnotherapy script pattern 9, Vernick. Concerning drinking blood from the chest of sleeping men, he continues to refuse baths or the attention of a barber outside of general anesthesia, stating, If I cannot partake, I cannot share. Recommend forced nutrition for Mr. Monero if we cannot find something he likes to eat. Murkoff, Psychiatric Systems Project Wall Rider, Mount Massive Michael, CO. So, the guy chasing me is a fucking horrible cannibal is called Frank. Nice. Nice to know. Oh, he's gonna come through that door for a sec. Go away. This is my place. Okay. Oh, I just go. Oh, I just go turn the gas off, mate. Sorry. No, I can't. No, I can't turn the gas off. I'll just leave you to it. No. Oh, fuck. Good day, and welcome to I'm shutting every door behind me because people scare my brain. <laughs> 